Hi right, guys, we called up this V800 with a consistently flat battery. The customer has taken upon himself to replace this, the battery and the alternator. I don't know if he's tested them, I don't know if they need replacing or anything like that. I just know that he has. Um, but the battery is still going flat. So what we've done is we've rigged up our multimeter to read the amp draw. So the amount of amps going through the car. So this car now is drawing 0.3 amps which is, is way, way too high. Something that these Fiat 500s and a lot of Fiat models suffer with is battery drain, Bluetooth not working properly, and the mileage flashing on the dash, which is what we're experiencing here. So we've come to the, the blue and new module, blue and me module, sorry, and that's tucked up in behind the panel here. Um, if you've got small enough arms, you can just lean in there and get it out. I don't know if I'm going to be able to record and do it at the same time. Let's try. There we are. And that's now unplugged. And as you can see, our amps have dropped down massively. 0.2 amps. So this here is still slightly too high. But I have noticed that it's got some sort of tracker. Or black box the insurance over by the OBD2 port. Um, that's the lights are still flashing on that, so it, I don't want to disconnect that um, just to rule it out. But the chance are it's that, and I don't think if this is driven regularly, I don't think that will go flat overnight. You can obviously see that that blue and new module is an issue, so we have advised the customer already to have that replaced. Well, you don't have to replace; you can send it off to ECU testings and get replaces. It's it's not a ten pence job. So the customer's the customer daughter's car, so we seek an approval off her first. Um, but yeah, if you have those symptoms on a Fiat 500, go and check that blue and me module. The chances are it's that. Okay, so whilst I've been packing up, I've just left that sit there, just to let it sort of settle itself down, make sure everything was gone to sleep. And as you can see, it's dropped down to 53 milliamps. Sort of 50 milliamps is within range. So with that, I'll just show you quick. Now with that black box doing whatever it's doing, I'm not sure if it's a tracker or if it's an insurance box or whatever it is. I don't know. But obviously whatever it is, it's got those lights on. Which is going to create a slight drain, but nothing too major. So I'm, I'm not massively concerned about that extra four milliamps.